Hello everyone, I'm Carly Hamilton here and I'm doing a haul video. Uh, this is my Studio Calico kit for August. It's only just arrived today, um, which is the 28th of August for me. Um, but I just wanted to give you a little show of what's in the kit and everything. Um, also, because they've changed the packaging um, and I hadn't really seen many videos i haven't been watching many videos to be honest but i haven't seen very many videos um with unboxing the new packaging for the project life kit so anyway this is the box that mine came in um so just uh like a normal um, cardboard box and then inside is the kit in its new box i have to admit that i was disappointed um when i heard that they were changing the packaging uh, because I use the previous packaging a lot in um, in storing a lot of my embellishments, but um, uh, as you can see, I opened up that uh, box and had a quick look at this one, and it seemed you know it's still it's still fine, it's still sturdy enough to use um, for packaging and stuff of my embellishments and stuff. So I think I think it's fine. Yeah, um, if I can work out how to open it. There we go. So that's what the new box is, it's just cardboard. And here's my kit. So they've covered it with some tissue paper. There's a little sticker on it saying my kit is here. Um, which I don't want to break because I love stickers. So I'll just rip the tissue paper. And it looks like my whole kit is just um, on that tissue paper there. So there's the box. Here's the tissue paper. Looks like my thingy was packed by Megan, so thank you, Megan. Let's move this aside and see what we've got in here. Okay, so first up, we've got this washi tape here. Um, and I believe these are like washi stickers. Let's get my scissors. No, it's not going to work. So yeah, from the first feel of it, you, it's very much made out of like washi tape material. It's a bit sticking to me. It's just been um, stuck down with some yellow washi here. And, oh, and as I pull that up, it's pulling off one of the stickers, which is, so they're just like um, circle washi stickers. Pretty cool. Um, I'm not really sure about this kit from seeing pictures online because um, a lot of the colours are very primary colours and I don't really scrapbook with primary colours all that much. Um, but one of the reasons why I wanted to subscribe to a kit was to put me out of my comfort zone. Um, so I'll definitely give them a go. These are all, oh, I'm just ruining the whole thing there. So yeah, they're, they're like circular stickers there. And Nala is very curious about that. You want to have a photo? Oh, yeah. Okay. Circular washi stickers. And next I have... These look like they're labels. Got some washi on my thing. Everything's a mess. Okay. And just ruin that sticker. But again, these look like they're really primary, very rarely coloured. But I'm a sucker for labels, I've got to say. Love labels. Now these are all one-sided. And they do have like words on them, like report, learn, supplies, due today. So they're all, this is very much like a back-to-school kit. Um, whereas here in Australia, for one... Um, our back to school year starts in um, the beginning of the year in January and I don't have any kids and I'm no longer going to university or anything but that's fine you can like um, well I use supplies could be used for like scrapbooking supplies my phone is ringing one moment okay I think what I was saying before my phone started ringing was that you can like supplies you could be using for scrapbooking supplies and you know other things um, you can always just cover it up with stickers or anything like that. So, love labels. Um, you, I even use these like to layer 
so I could just have half the label sticking out. There's the label. I've got some kind of envelope here. This is just a envelope with the string thing, a little pocket. So that's that's interesting. <laughs> um, again, I'm not so much into red, but I have just started up my um, Japan album for when I was living in Japan, and I did use a lot of red in my previous Japan albums. So I'm thinking that this could be really cool to store some kind of ephemera in in, my, in that album. Next, we've got some plastic tabs. So these are actual plastic tabs by the looks of it, and then like bits of paper that you slip into the tabs. And again, they look like they're like school themed with the words, but you could probably just put whatever the hell you want in the tabs. Um, I hate this kind of packaging that I just can't open it cleanly. There we go. So lots of little plastic tabs there. Probably tells tells me on the packet where I just ripped up how many maybe. No, just plastic tabs. So we've got things here like show and tell, supply list, documented, bright idea, pinned and loved, and current current slash reading. And then just the little plastic things that you fold over in half. So they're, they're kind of cool. I really do like um, tabs and things, and I haven't really incorporated many like hidden pockets and journaling and tabs and things into my um, scrapbooking. So I'm kind of excited with them. Um, even if the, I mean, like current reading, that's kind of cool. But you know, I'll you know, I can't. I haven't actually really looked. Uh, what we're getting in this one so this is kind of a surprise for me usually I know exactly what's happening with a lot of this stuff but um, this this month you know haven't been into scrapbooking very much in fact I only just started it up again today so I'm really happy that this stuff arrived today so here we've got some um, some like transparencies so they're like plasticky and you know they say things like hey smart cookie better with you let's go exploring a plus and then some stars so again they're like the primary sort of colors um which i'm not so much into and transparencies i find always you know difficult to stick down because you see the adhesive no matter what you try at least for me anyway but um again I subscribe to a scrapbooking kit to try different things and I've got to say that Studio Calico pretty much deliver something really awesome every month. I think this is maybe, I mean I have to go back and look back, but I think this is maybe the first month where I've just been a bit meh about and you know, you've got to be happy about that. So here's some silver, silver alphabet stickers. I'm not really sure about the font on this one, it's really rounded. Um, bubbly i don't mind silver um and of course the latest trend has been gold 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 so a lot of what i've got is gold rather than the silver um but the font is really the and this one i'm not i'm not really loving the font maybe i'm just being super critical but i shouldn't be okay and now we got some wood veneer and um I'm in the middle of setting up my scrap room at the moment. It's a complete pigsty, but I'm gonna be. I'm really excited to show you um, what I've done with it, and um, like with my wood veneer storage, my wood veneer um, like collection has grown significantly. Uh, I don't have like room for these ones, but these banners are really cool. I kind of really like them. That says morning. Um, love you to pieces. XOXO, what is it? Best, what? Best day yet. <laughs> that took me a moment. I, I thought that day was something with a my, and I couldn't quite work out what the hell was best my, best something, my, but it's best day yet. I'll stop loving. And then two blank ones. So some cool banners. And again, you can, um, 
you can go over the writing that's on there with like little letter stickers and stuff. And what's this? This is the stamps. Designed by, photo by, written by, made by, and then like a little banner. I've got to say I'm a bit un underwhelmed by this one. Um, usually I love the stamp sets, I, I, but this one just seems a bit boring. I don't know. Maybe it's just, maybe I'm in a bad mood. <laughs> I don't know. I have been um, homebound now for a couple of days because I sprained my my ankle so that's not fun um, especially today looks like it's well actually the weather's been off and on it's sunny now anyway this kit is called Sandlot August 2014 that's just, I keep the card, the white card, um, you know, for backing and stuff. Okay, let's go through the cards. We'll go through the, the big ones first. Again, I haven't really paid much attention to what's coming, so this is all different for me. Maybe we'll just move some of these things out of the way. Okay, so we've got this one here. I have actually just ordered some um, some inserts for pocketed pages because um, I'm planning to do more pocketed pages pages um, in my Japan album that I'm working on at the moment. I just ordered design A and um, I also ordered design K which is pretty similar to design A except it has the 4x4 squares at the top and the bottom instead of the 4x6 so I can do some like squared. I don't have any like Instagram images from that time. Um, but I can fit in more photos. Uh, I can probably trim down a lot of my photos to the 4x4 size and, you know, have more photos in there because I've got so many photos. Anyway, this card, Hello Adventure. I really do like this card, but I'm not really sure about the, like, the photo cards because I feel like the photo, like, the, um, yeah, all the photos on the page should be, like, my photos and this is sort of distracting from the photos, but... You know, I haven't used them yet, so, um, you know, maybe that would work. Otherwise, I've got that side. Again, a school one, and then just school lines. So I'm not sure. I mean, I, I don't hate it. I just don't know if I have a situation where I can use that for at least, you know, six years or something. Every book is a new adventure. Now, love, love that. <laughs> because I'm a huge reader. The best chats are over a cup of tea. Unfortunately, I don't like tea. But I don't mind that card. I just don't drink tea. Ah. Live fully, tell your story, repeat. Now that's cool. I like that. It means I have to go... Um, yeah, I don't... <laughs> I didn't have any... Um, uh, what am I trying to say? The pocket of pages with that kind of orientation for the 3 by 4s so. But I do like that. It's a boy reading, and again, I don't know. I don't have children. I don't know. Green. Light bulb. About us. So that's cool. I like that a lot. Yeah, that one's really nice. Take a deep breath. Maybe there's a situation that... <laughs> books and coffee. You know, I said I don't like tea. I don't, also don't like coffee. I do like books, so... I wish I liked coffee and tea. Make more. I like that. Awesomeness. If you know me, awesome is sort of a word I use a lot. Everything's awesome. Let's say just a note. Probably like the just a note side a bit better. Girl with a book. Again, 
Eh, I guess I'm a girl with a book. <laughs> uh, what a beautiful morning. Oh, what a beautiful day. Good stuff right here. Here's the scoop. Number eight for an infinity. Why eight? Oh, August. Nah. <laughs> okay, world's greatest. And then a line. That's cool. World's worst. <laughs> I like it. Mm. Ampersand. Today's headlines. That could be a cool prompt idea. I guess if you're doing some kind of, you know, project life today thing. Currents slash reading. I don't know this current slash reading like is that something people say i feel like it should be just currently and then we can like write about what we're reading or whatever or, or it should just be currently reading or i don't know hey hmm. anyway that's this month um not the biggest fan of the color palette or the theme but um I'm determined to use it because I paid for it. <laughs> um, but I think I think that um, it will give me a good opportunity to try and do something different, um, stretch my comfort zone and all that. And that's one thing I want to do with my scrapbooking is definitely scra uh, stretch my comfort zone. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Uh, my name is Carly Hamilton and I'll see you next time. Bye.